Hello mga matusiast! Welcome back sa ating YouTube channel kung saan ang mat ay mas pinadadali at mas minamahal. For today's video, tuturuan ko kayo kung paano ba mag-identify ng slope, ng x-intercept, ng y-intercept, at ang equation ng line kung binigyan kayo ng graph. Pero bago ko ituro yun, siguraduhin na munang napindot nyo na dyan ang like button. O, pindutin na. At syempre, kung bago ka pa lang sa aming YouTube channel, pindutin mo na rin dyan ang subscribe button. At i-hit mo na rin ang notification bell para lagi kang updated sa mga videos na i-upload ko. Okay na? Okay na. So, let's start. O, mga anak ha, mabilis na mabilis lang tong video na ito kasi medyo, hindi medyo, madali lang naman talaga kung paano natin ito gagawin. Okay, let's start with the x-intercept and y-intercept muna ha. Tatandaan nyo na ang x-intercept, Inter intercept, siya yung intersection ng graph natin sa kanong x-axis natin. So, kung titingnan natin, ito yung graph natin at ito ang x-axis natin. So, saan sila nag-intersect? Dito. So, anong coordinate dito? We have negative 3, 0. So, yung x-intercept mo ay negative 3, 0. For our y-intercept, yan naman yung intersection ng ating graph at ng ating y-axis. So, kung ito ang graph natin at ito ang y-axis, saan sila nag-intersect? Dito. So, you have there, o oh, ano ang x niya dyan? Since hindi siya kumanan, hindi siya kumaliwa, 0 siya. So, 0 and then you have 6. O, oh, diba? Ganun lang siya kunin. For the slope, we have rise over run. Pwede nyo naman din gamitin yung formula na y sub 2 minus y sub 1 over x sub 2 minus x sub 1 kung okay kayong mag-solve. Pero kung hindi naman, eh di rise over run tayo, diba? Rise over run. So, we have rise. Ilang beses tayo tumaas? 1, 2, so... 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 6. Okay, ilang beses tayo nag 1, 2, 3. Okay, so what is 6 over 3? You have 2. So your slope is 2. Now, for our uh, equation, diba? Since meron tayong equation. Since meron tayong slope and y-intercept dito, pwede na natin gamitin yung y is equal to mx plus b. So, you have your y. Wala tayong value ni y. Ano ang slope mo? 2x plus, ano ang y-intercept mo? Ito, yung 6. O, ayan na. Meron ka ng x-intercept, y-intercept, slope, and equation. Okay, para sa isa pang example, dito tayo ngayon sa number 2. We have the x-intercept. Again, ano yun? Siya yung intersection ng x-axis at ng ating graph. Ito si x. Ito yung graph natin. So, you have here this one. So, so sorry. This is negative 1, 0. For our y-intercept, we have the intersection of our y-axis and our graph. So, that's what? Ito. 0, 2. For our slope, o M na lang ilalagay ko ha, pero alam nyo naman na M stands for slope. Okay, so we have rise over run. So, ilang beses akong pumanik? Isa, dalawa. So, you have 2. Ilang beses ako nag run? Isa. Over 1. So, you have 2. Ah, pareho pala silang 2. Ah, ayan. Now, for our equation, oh, di madali lang din i-identify yung equation natin. We have y is equal to, ano yung slope mo? Kasi mx plus b, ba? 2xk plus, you have here 2. Ayan na. Okay, now for our third example, kung mapapansin nyo, iba yung direction nito. Ano kayang mangyayari mamaya? 
So, let's start with our x-intercept. As ah, anjan Intersection ng ating x at ng graph. So, you have here 3. So, 3, 0. Ang ating y-intercept naman ay intersection ng ating y-axis at ng ating graph. So, we have here 0, 4. For our slope, o, oh, ayan. ba rise over run. So, ilang beses tayong pumanik? Isa, dalawa, tatlo, apat. So, apat. And then, run. Kung mapapansin nyo, yung run natin dito, ba pa kanan, pa ganon. Pero this time, pakaliwa na. Which means, ang magiging sign natin doon ay negative. So, we will have here, 1, 2, 3. So, you have there negative 3. Kaya, ang slope mo ay negative 4 over 3. Okay, for our equation, you have here, aha, y is equal to negative 4 over 3 or negative 4x over 3 plus Yung y-intercept mo na 4. Ayan, napaka-bilis lang ng ating video ngayon ha. Ganyan lang ang gagawin ninyo. Ngayon kung may natutunan kayo dyan at nakadali itong ating video dyan sa ginagawa nyo, please write a comment ha. Kahit simpleng thank you lang ay okay na sa akin. Basta mag-comment kayo. Don't leave ng hindi nakakapag-comment. Okay, let's spread the love of math. Thank you. And bye!